Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Rock Slay back here again with another way review. If you are a new viewer, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button down below and show your girl some love and be sure to hit that bell button so that you don't miss more videos like these all right so today i'm going to be showing you guys a wig review on this hair that was sent to me from fridaynighthair.com it is the gls 68 i believe where's the stock card let's see here Yes, it is a GLS 68, and I have it in the color 1B. So these are like really, really, really tight curls. Um, it kind of looks like a little jerry curl-ish. All right, I haven't done like a curly hair like this in a while. The lace is a hard lace, and this is how much lace you get with the unit. You guys see that? Now me personally, like the this on the side right here like the lace on the side right here it's always difficult for me like when I'm cutting it because it always ends up like sticking out on the side like right here I think because I have like a smaller head like it doesn't come all the way around my head but anyways this hair has your two clips in the front with your clip in the back and your adjustable straps and look how realistic that hairline looks you guys y'all see that it's so freaking pretty all right now um, I do have my argan oil leave-in conditioner that I will be applying to this unit so that it has that wet and curly type of look that we're trying to go for here and I'm gonna go ahead and cut off the lace. I'm gonna put it on so you guys can see what it looks like before I do anything to the unit. And then um, we'll go ahead and cut the lace and do all of that extra stuff. Um, please excuse my stocking cap. For some reason, I could not find my black ones. And this one has like makeup and stuff, as you guys can see. And it has a hole, it has a hole back here. But don't judge me, don't judge me. All right, so let's go ahead and get right into this review. So this is what the unit looks like. Put on, let's go ahead and put it on first things first. It's like big and curly. so it's a little shorter.
cut out the baby hairs and try to gel them down. Um, I just wanted to come and talk to you guys for a quick hot second. Um, trying to create baby hairs with this unit, y'all, is very difficult. It was very difficult for me. I don't know if anyone else experienced these type of issues with this hair, but it was very difficult for me because trying to pull the hair from the curl, it just kept getting tangled. So yeah, um, right now I tied it down because the hair is so curly and the, and the curls are so tight. Um, even when I used the got to be glued um, gel, like some parts were just not staying down, like they were just not cooperating. So I figured, um, let me go ahead and tie this down for a little bit. Um, I would say tie it down for maybe about five minutes. I've had it on for about two minutes so far. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to come and talk to you guys really quick and let you guys know what I was doing off camera as far as creating the baby hairs. Alright, so I'll be back once I go ahead and take this off. Then I'll show you guys how I apply the makeup to the parting space. Of course, I'll be using my NYX palette. And the colors I normally use with this one, this lighter color, it's almost out. So I'm going to need to buy a new one. I've actually had this for about two years, you guys. So um, I normally use this one. And then I go on with the darker one to kind of match my complexion all right um, and then if it's too dark I just go back in with this one right here all right so I will be right back So this is the final look right here that I've decided to go with. Just a few things that I have to say about this unit before I end this video. Number one was the baby hairs. As I've told you guys previously, I did struggle when creating the baby hairs solely because the curls are so tight. So when I actually applied my Got To Be Blue Gel on there, the curls were just popping out. Like it just would not stay down. So I had to tie it down for about five minutes and then it was able to stay down as you guys can see um, I did receive a lot of tangling when creating the baby hairs so I would not suggest that you try to tease this out if you do just try to fluff it out just like this don't even bother trying to tease out the curls because you will receive some snags in there now as far as shedding this hair does not shed so I, I absolutely love that about this hair I did apply makeup to the parting space and also I applied makeup around the edges a little bit simply because of the stocking cap that I use it's a whole lot lighter than my skin complexion and I had to apply makeup uh, simply like I said I couldn't find my black one you got I couldn't find my black stocking cap earlier so 
this is what I had to go with, all right? And I went with this look here simply because it was entirely too much hair for me. Like I cut out a whole lot of hair with this unit. And the great thing about this is that once you keep teasing it out, it'll get longer. Um, you don't necessarily have to have it this short. But other than that, I think it's super cute. All right, so once again, I did receive this hair from FridayNightHair.com. It is the GLS 68, and I'll be leaving the link down in the information box below if you guys are interested in purchasing this unit. Thanks for watching, guys, and definitely stay tuned because I'll be back with more videos pretty soon. Bye, guys.